if if we could please have the only Australian fan of American baseball, Boots McGee. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Welcome. 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 Enter the uh, the torment chair. Now, uh, these chairs are fitted with wicked spikes, um, coated with bacteria. They're not. Um, I don't know, it got worse at the end. Now, it's, a, it's an allergy test. Yeah, but this is only half of it. This is not enough. We, this is not enough for a Nomegathon final round. We need two people. Our other contestant, the Lord of the Tongs, Corbs. Corb, 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 Corb. 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 Long may his mithril tongs gleam. Now, uh, if Maybe we not could... much longer. Yeah, uh, Perhaps not much longer. All right. G'day. G'day, everybody. Bloody, how you going? I see some people in the old chatette there. Grace, nobody. How you going, man? Great to meet you on the weekend in the in Melbourne. Rock and stone, brother. Hulk Bogan, mate. Bloody great to catch up with you in Melbourne. Guess how many times I'm... Drink every time I see Melbourne this stream. <laughs> Fucking hell. But yeah, Grace, nobody. Great to meet you. I wish we could have gotten a photo. I wish uh, in the moments I was more like, let's get the photo now in case I don't see you again instead of being like, oh, there'll be another time. And then there wasn't. So, but Grace, nobody. Great to meet you all the same. Descendant, mate. Thank you for your support in the Discord while I was away. Letting everyone know uh, when the... Um, the Megathon rounds were on, when my speed run was on, coordinating shit in the Discord. Thank you so much, bro. Moderator for realsies. Tay be gay as well. Tay, thank you so much for the support over the weekend. I saw you all through the Discord. And the drawing you did, that made me tear up a little bit. Thank you, Tay. I hope you, I hope you can hear me. I know you're lurking, but Tay, I hope you can hear me. I appreciate you. Because Zozo, thank you for the resub. 18 bloody months. What's up, bitch? Zozo, it's been great playing some Overwatch 2 with you. I hope we can... <coughs> excuse me. I hope we can climb the competitive leaderboard. It's been fun. But yeah, I feel you. We're getting old. We're getting old and it's hard to keep up with that game. But we'll keep trying and we'll school these kids. Your Tay is... Potato, hello. As again, lovely to meet you over the weekend at PAX. I wish we had more time where there wasn't just shit going on all the time. Hello, Hello there. General Kenobi. That's my plan for... Pa General Kenobi. Hello there. You are my brother, Anakin. I, my plan next year for PAX is to get there days earlier and leave days later. Yeah, they're coming, they're coming to PAX again next year. We're going to compete again. Why can't they just let me die? Uh, but yeah, I want to get there next year. I want to get there earlier and later so there's just more downtime where you can just actually have a conversation without being like, I got to get to this next thing. Oh my God. Oh, count the sand in the hourglass, my dudes. We There's no time. There's no time. Keep moving. Um, The potato, lovely to meet you regardless. More time next year, I hope. Because Zozo, I washed my hair fucking 100% on the, like, the Thursday or the Friday night. I fucking nuked it with conditioner and shampoo in the hotel and just blow-dried the shit out of it. And then for the final day, final night, my friend Marsley, she straightened my hair, which I haven't had it straightened in, like, a decade since I was at uni doing theatre and that. It was amazing. Amazing. Oh! Oh, my tongs! They're in my bag still, Mr. Phenom. Mr. and Mrs. F Mr. and Mrs. Phenom are still in Melbourne, I think. I'm very jealous. Dopey Dill! Dill, mate. Good to good to meet you as well. This, this is all I'm going to be saying all stream. Bloody good to see you on the weekend in Melbourne, mate. No, it was great. Dopey Dill uh, and I had to have a few little conversations. Double tonguing. Double clacking. Double tonguing. That's, that's my applause for you. All the clacks. All the clacks to everyone that supported the Omegathon and PAX in general that I got to meet at PAX in person and everyone online that supported... Um, my bullshit <laughs> in the Omegathon. Clacks for all of you. It, you've... 
you bastards. I fucking, I fucking, my tweet, my tweet about wearing sunglasses on the plane was not a lie. I legit, I was like, and I, and I, I shit you not. I was like, I don't know, 10 rows down from Jordan Rasko on the same plane back to Sydney. I was fucking, my tear, my fucking eyes, man. I was just like, <laughs> I don't want to go. And it was, it was messed up because I just, what a, what an event. But Dill, it was so good meeting you, dude. Dopey. Um, oh, I wish we had more time to chat at the Genos after party on the Sunday. There was just not enough time. I need more time next year. I really do. I really do. I really hope we get, both get to, we're both in the next generosity event. I really hope. I don't think it'll be the last we've seen each other or like anyone else there. I think there'll be more shit within the next year. Before PAX, there'll be a bunch of shit. I have a feeling. But nobody, oh, mate, the greatest nobody. Death Mouse. So what shenanigans be happening here? I am still dead tired, Death Mouse, from PAX. Um, I've been, I went, I literally, I got off the plane. My, well, as you know, if you were following my ranting on Twitter, my plane was delayed and I had to stay overnight in Sydney. I got back into town a day late and then I, I literally drove from the airport to work uh, because they needed my, they needed my help because we we're people down. Uh, it's been a week. It's been a week. And then I'm like, Oh, I got a stream Thursday night. I don't know what I'm going to do. Um, the plan tonight, uh, I'm going to keep going through the chat. Just one sec. Um, the plan tonight is get all the PAX recap stuff out of the way. If anyone wants to hear my stories or look at some photos, we can. But, you know, just go look at my Instagram. I've successfully deployed all the photos on Instagram. So it looks like I go outside sometimes. So it's done. I'm sorry about the spam. It's done now. My Instagram looks really nice now. Um, the plan is tonight I might... If you want me to do another Kingdom Under Fire Crusaders Lucretia speedrun, Gerald's having a break. We are fucking done with the Gerald campaign for as long as possible. But if you want me to do a Lucretia run tonight, we can. Or I might try out Medieval Dynasty, which is new on Game Pass, which, which should be chill. It should be nice and relaxing. Something nice to just play and talk with, you know. So that's the plan, Death Mouse. Descendant was the real MVP. And he better be at PAX next year. It was a big thing, Descendant. I appreciate you so much, bro. Dan, mate, how you bloody going, mate? Dan better be there next year too. I had to tell some people. I'm like, so many people. I'm like, Dan would be here if he could, but he could. Blah, 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 blah. And they're like, fuck that guy. <laughs> I kid, but Dan, he better be there next year. Better be there next year. Potato Wednesday to Wednesday sounds really good. I want to do that. I, and I really love the ideas of like Jesticles and others on Twitter. If anyone saw where they're like, we need more things that are less, more events that are less surrounded, like sort of gravitating around alcohol and clubs and that. So I'm, I was, I want to get, I want to like hit up Jesticles and, and, and Middleton and all that. And just be sort of like, what if we all just go to a fucking park and have a big fuck off picnic or something? during the day time like just as an idea that could be really nice i think um that's my two cents there um because it's oh dude it's hectic it's hectic yeah that nobody right i could take two weeks off mr and mrs phenom they're going to like art galleries and they're like driving around in a high current there's so much to do so much to do so much to see in the melbourne back streets i'm gonna drink some juice Oh, Descendant, maybe next year. Maybe next year. But Dill, yeah, man. But Hulk Bogan, if Descendant was the MVP... I love the puppy. If Descendant was the MVP of the Discord online, Hulk was arguably one of the MVPs, if not the MVP in person. Um, Hulk was great to hang out with all weekend. Marsley may get the top spot because she would... She was like holding my bag and jumper and that. Like she was really looking after me. I felt so bad, but she was going to town. Marsley, I don't know if she's going to be in chat tonight, but she was fucking awesome. I love Marsley so much. Potato, I didn't get to say hello to Jordan Rasko all weekend. I, there was like, I, I, I saw her briefly at the Genos after party, but I was like, there's, there were some people where I was like, yeah, man, I can just rock up and be like, yo, I'm Corbs. But there were some people where I was like, we haven't really 
cross paths at all, and I just I get nervous, and I was conscious of time. Maybe next year, but I I, I would like to say hello to Jordan Esco, and I didn't want to say anything on the plane. I was literally when we we're like waiting to like line up to get off the plane. I was like next to her, and I'm sort of like. Do I say hello while I'm standing awkwardly with my bag and she's waiting to get up? Nah, I'll wait. I was like, I'll, I'm going to behave. I'm going to behave. I wanted to, though. Fire Fairy. Fire Fairy was great to meet Dan. Yes, she spoke to the founders of Penny Arcade about the Church of the Tongs. We might get a tong pin next year. That would... I Then I'm done. And then I'm done. I've, I've done my part. If, if a tong pin happens, I, I'm done. I, I, I can't. What else can I do? What else can I do apart from win? Nobody. I appreciate that. I feel very bad for the spam on Insta, but it had to be done. Or else it'd be drip fed across weeks. And I was like, I just want to get this done. I got I got work to do, man. I got to get back to the radio station and do work. Um, I just, it's, just, it's just nice because it's like now my Insta looks like, yeah, I go outside. Sometimes that's my annual leave my cave. <laughs> but I wanted to take so many photos with people because like I sometimes I I'm always like on holidays. I'm like, yeah, I'll remember this. And then weeks later, I'm like, I don't remember that. So I just wanted all these photos with all the people I've met so that I could look at it and be like, it takes me back there. Cause it's just, you don't know. I, I can't express enough how much it meant just being able to like every day, just constantly bump into great people and be surrounded by friends and that. Like it was just so nice. That's how you that's how you kill depression in the world. You just have like a worldwide pax every day. So people can just be around cool people time because you can't be you, you don't have time to think about bad shit when you're around so many good people like that. The after party was good deal. I need more time and I need more energy. I went to bed by midnight. I'm such a bitch. Um I probably will just play Medieval Dynasty. Um and we might have some funny times with that. You suck at parking is fun, Dan. I'm all right at it. Dan, you better fucking be there. I bet it was Potato. I haven't seen any photos of the gala yet, Potato. Can you please share them? Cole's platters, mate. I'm a Woolworths boy. Dill, how much money do you, do you spend on alcohol? Oh, my God. Oh, Mrs. Phenom. Oh, seeing, like... The, the first day in the morning when I was like... Because being in a Meganaut, we got to be behind the barrier as everyone was lined up going to go in. And like, heck, Steph walked past. And I'm like, why am I behind the barrier? I'm a little... I'm a baby streamer still. Like, a Megathon or not, I'm still a baby streamer, bro. Oh, Meowtings. Flattery will get you anywhere. Meowtings, thank you, my dude. Dude, it was an experience. If you haven't... If you didn't get to watch the live videos... Um, I will share somewhere at some point how you can watch them, the recordings, if you wish. Um, the Gang Beasts round and the final round and charades in particular. Those were the best ones. But yeah, that's my that's my claim to fame being in the Omegathon. It was, it was nuts. It was awesome. You're the Phenoms MVP, Potato. Potato. You are like the PAX expert. Potato knows how to fucking navigate PAX. Potato, it should be like PAXado. I'm gonna shut up. <laughs> yeah, I've already streamed Metal Hell Singer. It's fucking sick, bro. Fucking sick. Potato, you should have just gone up and said hello instead of yelling. Like, the amount of people we had, like, at one point in one area for PAX was nuts. If we can make that bigger next year, holy crap. Like, so, oh, I'm going to have to try and list people in a sec. I'm going to need to bring out my Instagram. <laughs> it's all on the Instagram, man. I did feel at home, Dan. I did. I did. Crown Casino at 4 a.m. Dude, I would not have survived that, but I, I hope you guys have fucking fun. Is that Queen Sokra? Oh, my God. You had two hours and you didn't take any... But there would have been photographers at the gala, right? You will sh share that with me. Share me that when you can. My bank act says, 390 bucks, Dill. Dude, that's that's a good effort. I mainly just... It was just... Uh, I don't think... I maybe spent 100 bucks? 100 to 200, maybe? Bah! Hulk mode. <laughs> there, the charades round. There's a new meme from the charades round. It's, I don't want to spoil it, but it involves, bah! 
Hambo! Hello? But, oh, the last... I watched the Mario Party footage last night and I was like, this is fucked up. I was like, I had it. I was like, I was watching it. I'm thinking, how did I come back from this? I was just looking at it. I'm like, this is not right. This is, I feel so sorry for everyone that was watching. That was scuffed. I don't know how. Like I, I came, I, I, I came, I brought it back with minutes within, like I, I had minutes to spare. Oh, oh my God. You, the, I was trying to keep my calm on stage, but like inside I was like, <laughs> I was like, this is it. Round one. I was like, this is it. I'm done. Boomerang film. Like, this is it. I'm fucked. Gang Beast was the first time I was like, let's fucking go. These people haven't played the game. I was just like, goodbye. Goodbye. Like, you should have practiced the game. And then Charades, it was like, bah. And then Mario Party was just whack. And then Finale, I was like, I don't care, man. I'm... I'm meeting the, I was backstage with the Penny Arcade dudes and coming on the main stage. I was like, I don't care if I lose, man. This is, I couldn't believe it. I look back at the footage and I'm like, oh my God. Oh my God. Bruh. The charades team. I was just, I was just happy for a charades team member to win. Um, Hellsinger is sick. If you like metal music and games like Doom. <coughs> Oh my god. Yeah, I, I'm not surprised you couldn't stop Potato. I'm not surprised. Potato, I could fucking hear. Every round of the Omegathon, I could hear yelling out, Cobbs and tongs and this and that. I could always hear Potato's voice. I'm no King Sokra. I'm maybe a, a duke at most. <laughs> Flattery will get you anywhere. Potato Nader, I like that. Oh, I'm so sorry for putting people through that stress. I I don't know how I made it. But the 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 IRL and online support that shit helped, man. Like I it I felt gooey inside all weekend. You oh, You don't know how corny you made me feel. I don't mean that I don't mean that in a bad way in that, but I just I was like, man, y'all too nice. Um, it was so nice to meet you too, Cambo. Like I've been saying, need more time next year. Need just some quiet moments to just really savor slow and steady conversation with everyone. It's it was just so go go go. I just want I just want a bit of room to breathe so I can real. I just I wanted to hear more. Like there was a time like uh, for example, I was um talking to Donkus at the General's after party. And I was asking her like, what do you do? And she's telling me about her jobs and the stuff she does on the side. I'm like, this is amazing. I want to hear more, but then it's like, there's no time. There's no time. It's fucked. Next year. Now I know what to expect. I think we all know what to expect now after COVID and that. Um, oh, Dan. And you've seen how good I am at Mario Party, but I was getting fucking schooled, dude. I was getting schooled. Boots McGee is way better than me at Mario Party, and that's a sight to see. Oh, Mrs. Venom, no. I I don't want to I don't want to be a sheep ever again. Um, improv was not my favorite thing in drama. Ah, uh, meeting Middleton. Middleton is what a guy, what a guy, and he has some funny shit in store, in store for everyone on his first stream back from PAX. He was a busy boy. I'm so excited to see it. If you if you've been following us on Twitter, you'll have a sneak peek of what to expect. Um, his OBS and stream game is just next. It's it's going up to the next level. And I'm so thankful to be a part of it. Um, I don't want to spoil anything, but yeah, check the Twitters with Middleton and I. Um, he... He's a good dude. He's a good dude. Tong Jester. Yeah, if I'm the Lord of the Tongs, and if Fire Fairy is the High Priestess of the Tongs, there's got to be other Tong peeps. Jesters and whatnot. Potato, a ruckus is a good word. I'm six foot two when I'm, when it's a good day. 
by my ankles. Good luck getting through my boots, my thick socks, and my jeans. Potato, uh, that's probably a good thing, so we're going to ease back into it. Next year, I imagine we'll probably see Xbox and PlayStation and all that there, I reckon. Um, oh, her Five Fairies Tong Crown. Amazing. It was so good to meet her in person. Oh my god, like, just... Uh, meeting everyone was so special. After COVID and all that, and the fact that there hasn't been a PAX in person since... Um, 2019? Like, it was huge. It was huge. But now I feel like they can ease back into it. And, um, it's gonna be good. It's gonna be good, I think. That's true. No Corsair, no Razor. I don't know. Well, if I, if I had of won, <clears throat> if I had of won the Omegathon, I would have won tickets to Axe West or East. Uh, or South. And I would have, and I could go to America. So next year, the pressure is on for me to win because then I win free tickets to go to PAX in America and we can meet there. There are some very tall jeans. Some very tall jeans. Yeah, no Nintendo, no Xbox, no Sony. Oh, Dan, it's been like, for those that don't know, Dan and I worked on some online panels in 2020. And that's how we met Lontre, and it, that just that just caused this effect to just meet so many people. And then, of course, 2021, first year in the Megathon, and now it's just going on. Um, who's going to stop the corpse from winning? Hands up. Hey, if anyone else, when they buy tickets to PAX next year, want to tick the little thing to say that you, you're happy to go in the Megathon, go for it. The, the thing is, if I ever get knocked out or I win, I'm going to pass the tongs on. Either both to one person or one to two people each. Yep, so one. Them individually to two people. I don't know how to English. You know what I mean. I'm thinking whether I win or not, next year will be my last Omegathon. I, like, I feel like three is enough. Three will be enough. Chev! Oh my god! Coming in with the sub! Chev was another lovely person I met. She's a, she's a streamer. Met her with... Oh, I know who's here! Met her through Lord Hartnips. Hello. How you going? I was at Sea Shanty's Dill. Um, Hulk Bogan and I came back and caught the last maybe hour of it. And I was just... I was in awe of the energy and that um and then i went to the thing after it for a little bit but then i had to go and sleep because i was wrecked man i was wrecked but i was just wow the energy the energy of all the sea shanty people i was i was in awe i was actually in awe i imagine potato would have some crazy um some crazy feedback um but chef how are you how are you? Let me check something. Oh my god. I forgot. Yes, I forgot. Yes, Chef streams as well. Was with Lord Hardnips. And that was another one. Lord Hardnips I got to meet in person. Oh, I, I'm good. I'm great. I have a PS4 that doesn't work. Um, I've been wanting to sleep all day. But I, I, I like I said earlier, as soon as I, I, I literally drove from the airport to work. When I got back, finally, it's just been back at it this week. So this weekend, I'm going to sleep like mad. Oh, okay. Game plan while while I'm on it. Okay, so tonight. Tonight, um, it sounds like everyone's down for just me to play something chill. So I'm going to play some Medieval Dynasty soon. It's new on Game Pass. I've never played it. I like medieval stuff, so it should be pretty fun. Um, and then, <clears throat> and then, this weekend... <clears throat> Excuse me. This weekend, uh, there will be a Warhammer 40k Dark Tide beta stream at some point. I got a key for that, so I'm going to play that at some point over the weekend. Dan and I are going to uh, jump in a Discord call as well, and we're going to make sure we're set for... So Dan's going to host the next Hot Tub stream for Halloween. That's going to be on the Saturday night at 9pm Australian Eastern Daylight Savings Time. 
Um, so get keen for that. We're going to dress up. We're going we're gonna to be joined by Hill568 and Vanish. Uh, and if you remember last year's Halloween stream, it was pretty fun. And then also uh, across like the Friday night of Halloween, the Sunday night of Halloween, whatever, I'm going to be streaming stuff like um, Poppy Playtime, Little Nightmares 2. So expect a few streams from me over the Halloween weekend and the big one being the Hot Tub one on, on Dan's stream. Um, what else is happening? Dylan! Raiden! Mate! Bloody, how you going, dude? How you bloody going? Oh, yeah, pretzels. Is pretzel too loud? I've still got pretzel going. I was hoping it was quiet. I'll turn it down a little bit more. Um, What happened to your Aussie internet? Dude, it's just... It's gone good, dude. Uh, we are just doing like a PAX recap. Debrief. Debrief, one might say. Um... But yeah, so Moss Frog! Oh, please don't get banned again. Please. Um uh, as for the Kingdom Under Fire, the Crusaders speedruns, the Gerald campaign is on hold. Because I finally got to do the run at PAX, it is on hold. The Gerald run, I don't know when I will do it again, but it will be a long time until I do it again. The plan now is for speedruns, I will be now uh, focusing on the Lucretia campaign. I, I know I can get a faster time with the PC version, and I can definitely get a faster time with the Xbox version. That is the next step for speedruns uh, for me. Uh, and then, of course, the Halloween streams. And then... Uh, oh, and then also related to the speedruns, I will be doing the the PC all-campaign speedrun uh, during the Christmas holidays at the end of the year. When the Christmas holidays start, I will do it as soon as I can before I go traveling or holidaying. So that's when that's going to happen when I've got, when I don't have work around. TPG's plan is 40 megabytes per second. I'm currently getting eight and uploaded shot as well. Why? And I imagine you've reset your modem in that. Why would I be doing that? I give me a little bit of time before I get into, back into BK. Captain Dingpot, hello! Thank you for the follow. You kind of look like Kadikarus. Who is Kadikarus? That name is amazing. Kadikarus. Captain Dingpot, I remember you from the Banjo-Kazooie randomizer stuff. How are you going? I be corpse. I am, I am a better speedrunner at other games, but I love Banjo-Kazooie. Oh, dude, I hate technical problems during a stream. It's like, what can I do? What what can I do? It's it's weird. Um, trying to think. Uh, yeah. So, and then uh, later this month, we find out if I get accepted for GDQ. Where if I get accepted for that, I will either be running the Gerald campaign again or the or the Lucretia one. I hope it's the Lucretia one, but we'll see what they say. Um. I think that is mainly it. Yeah, so the immediate ones is tonight, Medieval Dynasty. And this weekend, Warhammer, Dark Tide, Beta at some point. I don't know when. I don't know when. We will see. We will see. But let me just give a quick shout out to as many people as I can remember from PAX. Let me quickly just bring up my Insta to jog my memory. Um, it's been nuts. Divine Vitriol! Belated congrats on your runner-up Omega status. D Vitriol, thank you very much. Thank you very much. It, I don't mind. I don't mind. Boots McGee was... Okay. I, I, okay, so this is what happened. So, Divine Vitriol said, like, one thing, and then my computer, I saw it out of the corner of my eye, it comes up with, like, GeForce Experience has a new update. And then I look over at OBS, and there's me, like, frozen, like, and I'm like, oh, my God. Bruh. Bruh. But, okay, so that, that helps me. 
But Lord Hartnips, hello, my dude. Wonderful to meet you. And Chev with the with the gifted sub. Stop it. Stop it. Um. So there will be Verk! Verk! Oh my god! I got to meet Verk as well! And the rest of those wizards with Lontre. Verk! Amazing to meet you, dude. The dickerous face. Okay. Let me quickly do that. I might, but yeah, so my train of thought there is. So two Ds. Um Kadikarus. I think I may have been ref I think I've already had someone say I look like Kadikarus. Yes! Yeah, 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 I think I have. Yeah. There you go. Um So there will be a time soon over the next few weeks where I so th very big thanks to people like Tucker. And uh, Vizsla in the community, who were the biggest contributors to my donation goal to upgrade my PC. They donated huge amounts. I've taken all the money, well, as I do, um, as I have to do, you know, but I've taken all the money I've earned over the last few months into my savings account and put it aside because I need to upgrade my PC. So the plan is one week soon, um, I'm taking, I'm getting, I'm going to get a specialist in town. I have a new really big PC case. I've got a new CPU. I've got a new motherboard and I've got a new internal drive. That will be my new C drive. Um, what are they called? Like M dot or something like the really good ones. I've got a few of those. I've got those parts ready to go. I'm going to go and get them to um, take all my current stuff out of my current case, put it in that and then replace the, the old stuff with the new stuff that I've got. Um, I need to get that done soon because um because stuff like that happens with my computer like um just things go weird and it affects the streams and it affects me when i'm playing games and trying to do video editing and whatnot and it's really annoying so uh huge thanks to everyone that's donated biddies gifted subs that directly donated to the sub goal um over the last few months it's um just thank you so much um i dipped into my savings a bit but a big dent was done and I owe it to everyone that supports the channel. Like even the, even the, the ad revenue adds up. So thank you so much. I will be upgrading my PC soon. Surely it won't take that long, but I might be out one week soon. So I need to do that after I get paid or two soon. Um, but yes, before we move on, I just want to give a big shout out. Just a quick thing to everyone. I remember, I remember meeting over the thing. It was crazy. I will probably miss someone. I do apologize. Um, but just going off my Instagram for memory, um, you know, all the Omega Noughts, Travis from Child's Play who runs it, um, my mate Jackson, Jacko McDermott in the Discord, uh, Shenanigans, who we got here? Chev, Lord Hardnips, Daddy Crude, Marsley, Mr. and Mrs. Phenom, Hulk Bogan, Jacko McDermott, Shenanigans, Potato, um... My friends from the Mag Nerds, uh, Daddy Crude's friends at his house, and we played some Xbox Connect. Classic Middleton, Princess Vicky, Cambo. Um, of course, Boots McGee, who ended up winning the Megathon. Uh, Hulk Bogan's friend, Nick. Uh, uh, Pixie Soup, I believe, on Insta and that. Jesticles, Princess Bella. Who else did I meet? Uh, uh, is it Vinyl Minty said hello? Um, Domkus, I met Blunty, Kayanator, I've met, we played some games with Classic Middleton, Burke, Lontre, The Crazy Toaster, Dopey Dill, Megs, I can't remember Megs's, na Megs's friend's name, I finally met my friend Anna, who was the co-host um, with Dan and I and my work during 2020, and with PAX Online 2020, um, who else, oh god, um, Oh god. Um I'm trying to remember. There's so many. Um uh, other people that came and said hello that I didn't get photos with. Uh Blake Tato, Mr. Buttersocks. Um Oh god. Oh god. Uh Oh Babosa! The Tong Jam is back! Mate, may not have come back with the gold, but I won the heart of the crowd. 
Thank you for the resub, bro. 40 months. Thank you, man. It's good to be back. I miss PAX so fucking much, but it is nice to be back at the same time. Um, puts me back down on the ground. Dan, I'm sure you will. She's got to go to Germany soon, but I'm sure you will meet her soon. We spoke about you and the whole mix-up where her or some people, they got us confused and they thought I was the one in Darwin. So they're like, oh, we went and met Corbs. And she's like, well, we met Dan and or whatever. And then she's like, but it was in Corbs, something like that. Um, but yeah, she knows now Dan is the one. Dan's in Darwin. I'm not in Darwin, unfortunately. Um, but yeah, Jess Teals and Princess Bella, they are such a pair. And just everyone around them in Middleton that just... It's nice. It was not, there was, there was a moment where I was able to just sit back and watch them all just chat and have fun with the green screen. And it was just really nice. Really nice. Um, Barbosa, hey, maybe one year, maybe one year you'll do an Australian holiday around the same time as PAX. And you can, that'll be your time doing Melbourne stuff, maybe. Maybe, maybe one year. Mate, Barbosa, you would have an amazing gamer experience. Melbourne in itself, Melbourne is one of the, if not the biggest cultural hub in Australia. Uh, the gaming, everything gaming wise, and then countless people to hang out with during the event and around the event. And that just, you've got me, Middleton, Dan, and like, everyone we know dude and everyone everyone that knows you loves you and then everyone that doesn't know you just they just don't know it yet it would be it would be amazing it'd be amazing um and you like you could then you know go to the beach go to an australian rainforest in your downtime like and you would have all the accommodation options and all of these people willing to drive you in that. Like you would, you would not go hungry. You would never go thirsty. It would be insane. It would be insane. Um, just, ah, oh, dude. Yeah, like an Australian holiday with packs in the middle. Hey. Right. We'll, we'll show you a good time, my dude. So I missed some things. Um, Dan, yeah, mate, you did well, Corbs. Your commentary on the speed was on point. And you were the most entertaining during the omega -thon. I, you know, being one of the runners up, I just, I already had that rapport with Travis and I sort of knew kind of what to expect. And I thought, you know, we, and you know, all throughout the weekend, generosity and GG well played and all speed runs and that. They'd, they've, they've constantly had donation goals for, you know, cure cancer and everything. So I thought, you know, even though these aren't panels directly for that, these are still part of it. And, you know, if we can, if I can then add to that with some laughs during this and help, then I've done my part. So that was my goal. I thought, you know, I, I, whether I win or lose, I want to actually, I want to help make this a show. Um, so I just, I had a ball. Ida Ball, and thank you for the comments about my speedrunning commentary. Hopefully, I get accepted for GDQ in January, which will be online, um, and I can do the, do it again. And this time not fail the run. <laughs> I did back off a bit in Gang Beast because I wanted to give the other players a chance to have a go, and also I wanted to um, create some laughs. I was trying to go easy on them, but it got to the point where I'm like, we got to stay within the hour, man. We got to stay within the hour. Decide to throw them off the edge. Mint nips, man, dude. I miss being there because it was like, I wake up, there's Marsley, there's Mr. and Mrs. Phenom. And then we just go out and do stuff. And it's like, oh, there's nips, there's Hog Bogan, there's Middleton, there's Princess Bella, there's Jesticles, there's everyone else. And it was just like, ah, oh. just. So nice. I said before, that is, you know, that is a way to defeat stuff like depression. If just, you can just, if everyone can like just 
find ways to include everyone and have like big events, little events like that, because it's hard to, it's hard to think about negative things like that when you're so busy doing fun things with cool people. I think that's how we defeat stuff like depression and anxiety. We just have to have stuff like packs constantly 24 seven for everyone in the world. Oh, Chev. Well, I, I like, like I, um, like I told Travis of that. I played it with friends at parties back in Queensland, and um, I did a lot of practice leading up to the Omegathon. I, I didn't want to. I wanted to go in as best prepared as I could. So I was watching YouTube, YouTube tutorials. I was going in and um, just exploring each level, practicing climbing, uh, practicing against the bots, practicing against people online. And I honestly, Gang Beast was the, the game I was uh, most scared about. But it was the game I did the best at. That just goes to show how how I knew what to expect. Um, I was most confident about Mario Party. But uh, we all saw how that went. Um, but yeah, just amazing meeting everyone. And for anyone that didn't get to watch the rounds and the speedrun live... I will, I'm waiting for them to, so I've got my own copies just in case as a record, but I'm waiting for them to upload the videos to their YouTube and then I'll share it. So if anyone wants to check out the rounds and you missed it, it'll be on their YouTube in a playlist and that. Um, if they don't end up doing it or they take too long, I'll just share the private ones I've got. So um, yeah, if anyone wants to see the, the bah and that, there you go. Div Divine, I, um, I forgot. I, I did not think I would be that good at charades. I much prefer guessing than acting stuff out. But thank you again so much for the compliments. I know, as you said hello before, that's when the stream uh, died. Thank you again, Vitriol. Thank you so much for the kind words. Um, thank you so much for everyone's support. <laughs> Sheep! Okay, before we get on Medieval Dynasty, does anyone want to see the sheep part again? Does anyone want to quickly watch the sheep part? We can watch the sheep part and then we can get on with Medieval Dynasty. All right. There we go. All right. For those that missed it, for those that missed it, here is one of the highlights. Here is one of the highlights from the Omegathon. This is, this is where just, it was like, what's going to happen? What's going to happen? It was, um, it was wild. Let's, uh, let's get this going. Let me bring it up. Uh, <laughs> oh, I was a bit nervous because I thought I did everything I could to make it easy for them, but, um, they weren't getting it. I don't want to spoil it. I don't want to spoil it. Okay. Let's me, no, that one. And then, okay, hold on. I need to. Quality, 144p, what the fuck is that? Okay, uh, where was it? Let me just find it. <laughs> so he went and then I think it was my turn. Digging, back, back pain. Uh, shaving. Oh yeah, Boots McGee. Where's me? I think I was after SD. Yeah, here we go. It might be a bit quiet. So we'll go, I'll go, we'll ease into it because I didn't do many before it. We might have to come up with your ideas. Or we do. Or we play like heads up on my phone or something. I All right, here we know. go. <laughs> okay, Corbs, are you ready? It's two minutes. All right, go. <laughs> it's not a bird, so Corbs doesn't know. Sleeping. Sleeping. Sleep. Sleep. Moon. Not. Bird. Owl. Nice. Ow, boom. And they've got it on my owl. There you go, guys. Yep. King. Oh, he's king. What crazy synergy is happening? Good. Bird. Dragon. Dragon. Fire. <laughs> Dragon. <laughs> it, uh, wings. Animals. Fire. Dragon. Yeah, Here we go. Oh, yeah. So they've got to slide down that way a little bit more. Although they haven't. Ball. Yeah. I thought I was what that was going 
One word. Shearing. Present. Four-legged animal. Panic. <laughs> I was shearing the sheep, man. <laughs> Frustrated. <laughs> Sounds, like. Sounds like. Sounds like. Away. Far. Far. Gone. Wind. Voice. Sounds like far. Bar. Singing. Four-legged animal. Shearing. I didn't want to get down again. I was like, fine, I'll get down on my fucking knees again. Bar, bar. All right. So bar. It sounds like far, and you're crawling. <laughs> 30 <laughs> seconds left. <laughs> sounds like far, yes. Um. <laughs> I was like, go back. Go back to bar, bar motherfucker. Bar, bar, bar. bar. Oh. He's on bar, bar, bar. 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 <laughs> this is all that I wanted. This is all I wanted for this game. You've given me everything I need with my life, corpse. Three, two, one, time. That was it. Sheep. Sheep. Sounds like bar. You take bar. <laughs> Skipping ruined everything. This is all that we needed. I needed corpse frantic. And then I just, I just fell down. Like, four-legged animal, four-legged creature that goes bar. What? What more do you need? <laughs> bar, bar. <laughs> like, fuck me, right? Like, I was like, I was thinking, because I'm like, what else can I do? What else can I do? <laughs> so that was the charade. That's a glimpse of the charades round. Um, there's some other gold bits in there. So, so yeah, I will. Um, so if anyone wants, like, my, I've got my unlisted playlist of this. Let me know and I'll link you. Um, or just wait till they're up on the PAX Australia web, uh, YouTube. I also want to do an edit of, like, all the highlights. That'll hopefully be under 10 minutes, so. Oh, excuse me. So there you go. So that's that's a glimpse of the Omegathon if you missed it. Good times. I see you're trying to demonstrate what a sheep is. Can I help you? <laughs> <laughs>